I'm now going to discuss some very basic microscope controls. So first of all, uh, on this microscope, moving the focus knob away from you makes objectives go up, whereas moving the focus knob towards you makes objectives go down. There is both a coarse and a fine focus here. In addition, if you go to the touch screen and click on this setting, there is a further coarse and fine setting which affects both of these. So this is coarse, this is fine, but in addition, they can be run in a fine mode where movements here on both of them lead to smaller changes or in a coarse mode where movements here lead to bigger changes. To move in XY, we have this motorized stage where deflecting the joystick moves the stage with the sample on the microscope. And pressing this button toggles between a fast mode, which is indicated by an F here, or a slow mode, which is indicated by an S here. And that just means that when we deflect the joystick, the movement of the stage in slow mode is slower than if we switch to fast mode. To change objectives, you can do that through this menu and you can just press the button that has the objective that you want to change to. If you are switching between two objectives of the same type, either air objectives or immersion objectives, the objective will just change and go to the same or rather parfocal position. If you are changing between an objective that is an air objective and an oil objective, if you press the corresponding button for the oil objective, you can see that it will blink and it will only change objectives once you press it again. It's important that before you change objectives to an oil objective, if you are going to need to add oil and the sample is there, you make sure that you lower the objective all the way to the bottom of its travel range. To accomplish that, we can press the down Z button here, which will move the objective, if you press and hold it, all the way as far down as possible. Now let's say we've moved the focus knobs until we have found a sample and it's in focus. In that case, what we will want is to set this position as our new working position on the microscope, which we will do by pressing this button and then this set button. And now what will happen is when we use these buttons, if we use the down button, we will go all the way to the bottom of the travel range. But if we press the up button and keep holding it, the microscope will go back to the position we had set as our working position. Now we can go beyond that by moving the focus knobs, but this allows a quick uh, lowering and returning the objective to the working position.